Hey guys, I want to talk a little bit about uh, these EM pumps that I've been seeing on TV and on uh, videos online and that kind of thing. Basically, it's just a little box that produces a, a small electromagnetic field. And the hypothesis is that, uh, you know, spirits and ghosts can use this electromagnetic energy to manifest and all these other different hypotheses. Um, so I'd like to play around with this a little bit just to see if there's anything to it. Um, you can get these things online. You can buy them. They're, you know, anywhere from, from 30, 40 bucks all the way up to 90 or 100 bucks. Um, but the most powerful ones that I saw can produce around, you know, 950, just under 1,000 milligauss. Now, that's a lot of EM. Don't get me wrong. That's, that's not bad. But I want something that's going to blow the fucking doors off. Um, I want something that you're going to be able to detect from, detect from 20 feet away with a, with a meter. Um, so I, I actually made one, um, and I don't know exactly how much it produces because my millimeter, um, I have, I'll show it in the video. I set it to, uh, 20,000 milligauss and it goes beyond that range. So this thing could produce, you know, I don't know, 25, 30,000 milligauss. Um, now keep in mind, just, just as a reference, you know, Zach and them on TV, they freak out over 1.5 milligauss or 2.0 milligauss. We're talking 20,000 20, plus. So it's pretty pretty neat little thing that I put together. Um, I'll show you a, a, a video of it. And, I'll, you know, like I said in the video, it shows me, uh, you know, setting the, the meter. Um, and then there's some comparison videos of some of the EM pumps you see online. Uh, the only thing I have to do with this, I'm finished with it now, but the only thing I got to do is find a, a project case for it um, in order to get that kind of um, EM field. It takes a lot of current, and this isn't something you want to be screwing around with and get shocked because it'll lay it, you know, it'll lay you out. So, uh, so here's what I came up with. Hope you enjoy it. We'll try it on this next investigation and see if anything, there's anything to it. All right, later. Alrighty, get it on. Now, K2, picking a little bit up off that magnet that's in there. That reading you're seeing, that's from the magnet itself. But when you turn that sucker on, then you get a wide EMF field. Yep. And that's what an EM pump is, and that's what it does. Give it a little more accurate reading. Again. Bring a little bit of a spike off that magnet. And you turn that sucker on, it pegs a regular EMF meter. And let's pipe it again. Okay. So there you are. That's an EM pump. Uh... And anyway, we're going to use this mill meter here. And I'll show you the difference between this one here, the little guy, and my big guy. Okay. Here we go, guys. We're going to check this out. We're going to turn. We're going we're gonna to use this. Let's see? Oh, pick something up there. Anyway, all right, guys. Here I am. I've got the uh, the mill meter here. We're going to go ahead and check this thing out. And uh, we got the temperature probe on it. It's 62 degrees. So it's how cold it is out here. Go ahead and turn this on. There we go.
Hey everybody, this is Dave Giuliano and Marty Haynes from the Ghost Hunter Store. Today we are testing out the new EMF pump by the new Entity Electronics. They are under new ownership. They're coming out with a lot of new and improved products. And the first one to come out right now is their EMF pump. This is not like the ones that you see online where you're running off of batteries. This is a high powered one. And what we're showing you here, we have a uh, 822A meter and we have a mel meter. Because this is AC current, it's going to fluctuate up and down. But as you can see, the mel meter is reading 616 milligauss and we're getting 192, a little bit over on the other side with the 822A. Now depending on the EMF meter, depending on the frequencies it's reading, you might not read anything. We're just showing you this to show you that it is putting out anywhere from say 150 up to 700 milligauss at any given time.